if you get my meaning. So let's take a quick look and see what Hermer Lane has in store. We got we got this massive bridge that go overlooks over this big old uh, or something like that. I am now a bondified rookie, which means I am just moments away from becoming a trusted user. Let's go. Also, look at my left hand. Wow. I have bread. <laughs> Somebody clip that or something. Oh, you got bread. bread. A wolf. Unfortunately, with the Andrea Tate, as in Tate Funny McGee. Yo. Uh, if I was frame perfect, I would have done that faster. Bye. <laughs> Missed. I bet you the flavor will come back up when uh, this finished loads again. Server is very finicky, especially because it's a new generation of uh, immersive railroading. Very smooth, very floaty. Float being a number. If you don't know what I understand float, if you don't understand what floats are, there's those little things that go across the parade. <laughs> Or would be like. So uh, come on in if you guys want to. Hey, no Toby. What did I tell you about not Toby on the? Stop Toby on the grass. What did I just tell you? All right, I'm here, this guys. dog is Toby on the grass. We're gonna have to start pretty soon. I don't know if we should have the timer for our ocean. Right? <laughs> <laughs> we should do it right spend the time getting the ready and then getting ready. <laughs> There's hundreds of dudes! <laughs> oh, well, well, goodbye! <laughs> Night! Wait, what? That was to the music! That was to the beat of the music! See, in Borderlands, you can't customize your own car like this can. Well, that's the case. I'll come on early. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am Kenneth Outthorpe, your host for today's uh, Making Custom Fireworks thing. Uh, usually, I use... Um, when I'm not making music, I usually make uh, fireworks on the weekdays. And uh, nobody supports me. So, uh, support my sanity. Figure is... Um, consider donating. But, uh, yeah. Uh, other than that, uh, Crack Rack saying hello, but saying, at the same time saying goodbye because I'm going to sleep. Well... Dream of foxes, and I will see you in the next one, alright? Sorry I'm so late. I, I it's, it, it's been a weird week, alright? It's just a weird every day, alright? Can we just say it's a weird every day? Is that allowed? I think that's allowed. Let's make that a thing. It's been a weird every day. Hashtag making stuff up. Anyway. I mean, hello everybody. I'm Kenneth Apsorp. I am a music producer. I write music. And I made four albums, uh, sorry, I made three COTC albums so far. If you want, if you're interested in listening to them, go ahead and hit my Spotify and the link tree down below. Um, today we're going to be uh, making some customized uh, fireworks today, and, and they're going to be a small cake. So hopefully this won't take so much time like last time, and I don't end up losing it at the end of the week. Yeah, you might have heard about that. Uh, Black Box and Pyrotechnics. I had to abandon those projects because both of those kicks broke. And I don't know how to fix it. So I'm just going to leave it as it is. It might sound terrible, 
It might sound completely sound bad, and I hated it as well. I wanted to change, but I still had to wait for the permission. I finally got the permission, by the way. But the mods broke before I actually implemented, so that sucked. That stunk, I should say. That, that stunk. So yeah, that's what my last week was about. Um, yeah. Oh goodness, I am I am looking at my stuff over here and realize it's so dusty. Let's let's start today by doing some exercise and uh, getting some dust away. So I'll uh, be right back, guys. <laughs> that moment when you realize that dust is on everything, you know it's bad. You know it's bad, chat. You know it's bad. Sheesh. I think it's my first time cleaning in a month. So hopefully uh, I'll wipe away the dust. I won't have to do this again for another month, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully. Oh, there was one place I forgot to advertise where I'm on right now. Um, I'm just going to make some mods today, and I hope you don't mind. Uh, it's something that I uh, really enjoy doing uh, as of late. Uh, I don't get supported for it, though. You can't make money off of this, but I, I still like doing it. It's like a hobby for me. So uh, consider uh, making me some money, guys. Donating. Uh, did you hear that the Digital Deacon finally launched uh, yesterday? Uh, got the little trailer going up on my YouTube. You should probably check that out as well. Look at that. Look at that, guys. This is this is all dust. This is nasty. It's nasty. And I let it sit there for a month. Jeez. Anyway, guys, uh, I am all about myself today, and that is not like me at all. So uh, tell me, guys, um, how have you been this week, all right? I want to ask you, how have you been today, all right? Just answer me that, and I won't feel so strange, all right? I won't feel so strange if you ask that. answer me that question. How are you guys feeling? Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, advertise on Lumeria that I'm, I'm making some custom stuff. So uh, let's go ahead and do that real quick. All right, one second, ladies and gentlemen. I need to do some promo stuff. All right, there we go. Alright, we are now here making some stuff, so let's go ahead and get started, shall we? Votes for who? Uh, votes for how we're going to get started? I have no idea, but uh, I do know one thing, that this thing needs to go way down so you can see uh, mostly what's going on on my computer screen. There you go. Alrighty, I'm going to move some stuff down so you can see my face. And what a handsome face it is. <laughs> okay, that's vanity. Let's let's not do vanity stuff at the beginning of the stream, shall we not? Let, let's not do that, shall we? All right, we're going to go ahead and get started on uh, figuring out what mod it is I am making today. And that is the pun, uh, Punifical, I believe it's Spanish, from Red Label. And it has these nice triangle shapes, so that'll be interesting. But... It has these firework shapes on the little front and sides of it, so that's going to be a bit hard. Uh, I can do the text easily enough. And uh, does it see anything on the top? I don't see anything like this. Like a little lid on the top. 
Oh, nope, it, you, it opens up. Okay, so let's take a little, look, good look at this, chat. Uh, looks like we have, like, little sandpaper-colored uh, tubes, which is a little weird. Usually, like, you see, like, black ones, but uh, this one's, like, sandpaper. So we got three that are angles. That's going to be three off the bat, three different fireworks going at the same time. We got four other ones going straight up. That's going to be one single emitter. Three other emitters going side by side. Another emitter, and so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven emitters from that cake alone. Sheesh. Okay. First things first, though, we got to create a model. So uh, here we are in SketchUp. We're gonna go ahead and create that model. Um, we are in SketchUp version eight. I'm gonna be using eight more. So uh, because because I feel like it. Um, so I can see the text. Uh, I'm gonna shorten down this window just a little bit. Gonna minimize that. Hello, chat. Anyway, um, hmm. Yeah, I believe that's enough for me to get my workspace going. Alright, so this is the size of a real human being. However, I am noticing. Oh, wrong window. I'm noticing that there's no size comparison for these guys. So it's hard to tell what the size of it is going to be. I guess I could figure out by the time of the explosion. Okay, tell me, oh, tell me, tell me not that doesn't sound like a bad sound. Oh, so it changes, chat. That means more emitters. That means more emitters, chat. Why? Why am I doing this? Oh, uh, well, we kind of promised, so uh, we're going to be doing it. Pernificol. This is going to be a tough one. going to be a lot of emitters. There's no size comparison, so I don't know what the size of it's going to be. From the, si from the side and size of these fireworks, I'm guessing these, they're going to be kind of big. Like, as big as someone's foot, maybe? Yeah, let's say foot. I'm gonna make an approximation, if that's alright, chat. If that's alright, chat, I'm gonna make, like, a little approximation on what that might look like. So I'm gonna guess that it's as big as a foot. So from here to here. No, that doesn't seem right. My feet are... Alright, hold on. My feet aren't that big, I don't think. I mean, I, I kind of have, like, these little big feet, but corner to the corner, that's kind of small. Hmm. Alrighty. How about two feet? Well, let's make thing a thing of two feet long, alright? So this is how easy it is to make a box in uh, SketchUp. Just hit the rectangle blue, start at the origin, wait for a line to appear, that's... The golden section that makes it a perfect triangle, uh, rectangle, and this makes it the perfect square. Uh, based on what I see, excuse me, I should look at the beginning of the video. Based on what I see, it looks to be about the a size of a perfect square. So we're gonna make it a perfect square. So we're gonna be about right dimensions is about 10 and one half inches all right we'll, we'll we'll take it just some more uh edits here there we go now we can see the dimensions and the first corner and stuff and things things that are relevant and uh, i'm going to be doing some quick modifications Whoops. So we can see more of the screen. I don't think we need level up. We can put this down here. Alright, Solar North, we definitely need that on. That, that's how you view the firework. And views, we're going to put those to the side. Uh, 
Uh, dynamic. We don't need dynamic at the moment. For this one. Alright, shadows. Important. Solids. I hardly use those. I'm gonna put those down here. There we are. Um, and wireframe. Kind of important. Alright, now we have more room to work with. Excellent. We're gonna go ahead and save that. Uh, by hitting toolbars and save tool below positions. Alright, that's just for me. Okay, so now we have a new rectangle. So how do we make it bigger? Uh, you hit this little button, you hit the push-pull button, bing, bang, boom, instant solid. Uh, how big is this? Do we even know how big this is? It's pretty thick. It, it looks like to be a perfect square almost. So with that in mind, we're going to make it do a perfect square. A cube, I should say. Kind of a big cake, if you ask me. Not my business, but it's still a cake. Anyway. So we have the cube now. So now it's time to make the box part. Then, I'm going to push this down about halfway or quarter away to her foot. That way we still have some room. That way we have everything in here. So that's the box. We're going to go ahead and make this into a group. We're going to call this box. Oh, we probably should say this. Definitely should say it everything we do. We're going to say this as, oh wait, what is this called? We need to have the name for this. Magnificle cake model. Bing bang boom. Looking at the chat just to make sure if everybody's listening, but so far nobody's listening because nobody cares. Kidding. They're just probably sleeping at the moment. If they're sleeping, then they're having a surprise when they wake up, I suppose. Anyway, so this is a perfect square, and it looks like it's going triangles. So let's start with the black and red scheme that we see here, and then let's work on the tubes. I mean, I, I guess I could work on each one of them later. Um, Alright, let's just go ahead and work on the tubes then. I mean, we have to finish the model first, kind of. So, by the looks of the tubes, it's by 3 by 4 by 3 by 4 by 3. Did I get that correct? 3 by 4, 3 by 4, 3 by 4. Yeah, it's like a big old sandwich. Remember that. Sandwich. Alright, so uh, we're going to go ahead and start right here, since it's kind of obvious that we're supposed to start right here and make a circle radius. Gonna go all the way up near to the box. Does that work? Or no, that does not work. I recommend you use the website from the seal. Um, is that okay? Oh, here we are. Yeah, that's actually helpful. Um, oh, it's a really thin, that's a really thin wall. I didn't even notice. Okay, so we obviously need to change that real quick. And it's rounded. That's weird. I've never seen a rounded shape before. All right, so compromise, ladies and gentlemen. All the things we just did. At the bottom, you have technical stuff. All right, thank you, Kalasar. I appreciate. So you can count, wait. You have the technical stuff? Really? All right, 17 shot cocktakes and get, oh goodness, okay. This is why I have translate to English. There we go. <laughs> it's a 30 cal. It's a battery of shot tubes, 25 seconds, height. Ah, here we are. Eight meters width, eight meters. So I was right, it's a perfect square. That's weird. Uh, but now I have to switch to meters. So uh, let me uh, really quick uh, change that. All right, uh, 
one of these has got to be it. Uh, template, here we go. Alright, feet, meters. And just like that, we change to meters. Alright, so one thing I want to change, the box is not 8 meters. What do you mean? It's it's not 8 miles, is it? It, it can't be that big. Oh, the effect is 8 meters high. Okay, so where's the technical specs on uh, how big the carton is? I mean, all I have is this. That would have helped me a lot. 8 meters is about 30 feet. Oh, okay. Well, we're going to make this anyway. <laughs> Thanks for coming into my uh, first chatter, by the way. Thank you for first chatting on my stream. I hope you have a good time here. Well, you can have a Cal 30. Yes, definitely have a Cal 30. So I'm just modeling at the moment. That's 30 millimeters. Oh, okay. Boy, am I dumb. I, I I didn't. I, I did not math correctly when I was in high school. In fact, I was homeschooled, so I blame that on ho homeschooling. <laughs> I blame that on homeschooling. Ah, so you can quickly how that big that big cake is. Oh, clever. Okay, definitely clever. All right. So first of all, we need to make a sphere that is exactly thirty-three millimeters. And that's big. Okay, so right there, right there, right there is the size of the tube, ladies and gentlemen. Apparently, all right. It's about I don't know if, how big it is, but I'm gonna guess it's about that big from how big it is. And then we're gonna make it inside, and there's the tube. So that's how big the tube is, and you have to have three of these in here? Hmm. Maybe the cake's not big enough. Let's make that into a group real quick, and we'll measure it by that. Uh, real quick, we're going to like put this right here. Use this. Whoops, I forgot to select the tube. It's a kind of important... And uh, we're going to put them like right here, right here, and right here. Does that look right? Ah, 20, 15 to 20 centimeters high, okay. I, I mean, how, I, I mean, I'm going to trust you on this one, Kaldazar. I'm, I'm going to trust you on this, all right? I'm going to trust you on this. So what we're going to do is point... Um, we're just gonna put nine. We're gonna go right in the middle. We're gonna go 19 cm. Actually, we should have waited. Oh well. So this is something to measure on. But the size of the tubes, I I know. I'm working on it. Just be patient. I, I I like to have consistency. I like to see if this is actual, is if, if it's gonna make sense or not in the model. And I want to make sure that, that actually makes sense. Fifteen centimeters. Oh well, there you go. Oh, okay. So definitely fits. Okay. So we want to make it. 15 exact. Interesting. Okay, so yeah, that definitely gets the right top of there. And now there's a problem. There's overlap. And now there's still more overlap. Okay, so... Hmm. I mean, I would. I would. And so would Drizzle. Uh, Super Drizzle. Super Drizzle would see all that overlap.
Let's like put it right close. Like so close you can't notice it. Alright, so it was bigger before. So let's just add a little bit of centimeterage to the end of this cake, just a little bit. And add a little bit more top. Yeah, I'm happy with that. If if you make like a little thingy in there, I'd probably be happy with it. Alright, so let's make it round. I have this idea. We're gonna like a little put like a little bit of midpoint right there, just a, like a measuring point. Then another one right here. And we're going to put these little measuring sticks right here. And, hmm. Is that going to be too round, I'm thinking? Yeah, that's going to be too round. We're going to need more measure sticks. So we're going to put this right here. And this right here. And how about now? If I put that down, oh yes, oh yes, I like that, okay, so what we're going to do is copy this, can make a little radius, and we're going to turn it 90 degrees everywhere. They say round around the tube, yeah. Oh, fiddly do. Okay. Why that's not working, I don't know. But if it wants to play like that, fine. Let let it play like that. Alright, let's try this again. Well, this time we're going to do it like this. There we are. And we're going to bring these down. And now we have like a little cake. Now I can just get rid of all the misery ones. Gonna save that. Yeah, this is like the first step. I usually like make like a little rough draft, and like this is really thin apparently. So we're gonna make this like real. Oops, sorry, wrong, wrong face. We're gonna make this like really thin, and then make it all the way down. Here we are. That'll be good enough. We're gonna make this into our group. They just, all right, sorry, they don't make it see at the bottom, they see around the tubes, so they have the same, like, the tubes, they make the cake just out of the tubes, and then put a label around the tubes, ah, interesting, interesting little factoids, if you want to learn of the, the real behind the scenes stuff about, about tubes, you hit up Kaldasar, ladies and gentlemen, he should start his own podcast about how to, how fireworks work. Probably make money off of it. Alright, there we go. So we need three of these to start off with. Let's bring them up just a little bit. Let's bring them closer together. There are people that know much more about that stuff than I do. Alright. And he's modest too. 
displays me on them. I don't know. I, I don't like that. If I bring that all the way down to the bottom so the wrap could fit in there, it would... It would make it. Okay. It would make it, definitely. Alright, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and start painting these. Sandpaper color. And uh, I don't know any other sandpaper colors. Hmm, I have to find one. Uh, this is about sandpaper color. So I'm going to guess. Alex the Gamer, hi, how are you doing? First time chatter, welcome to the stream. I hope you enjoy your time here. Uh, how are you doing today? By the way, is the music too overbearing? I, I seem to have that problem many, many times. No, I don't think so. Just have lots of commercials, that's all. How is your day going so far? Actually, it was a lot of work today. I had to wake up with chores, and I carried around until now. So, uh, yeah, that's what, what my day's been so far. Hey, Alex the Gamer. Yeah, hi. How are you doing? Uh, we're just getting to the uh, sandpaper colored uh, tubes, which is weird. It is weird to see sandpaper colored tubes. I'm just going to say that now. Alright, we're going to go ahead and use these as a measuring tool. These are not going to stay. And then these. Again. And then another one of these. Oh, man. Looks like we did not make it. Oops. Well, we can fix that. We can fix that. We're making a cake. We're making a model of a cake. Easy as that, ladies and gentlemen. It's, it's literally as easy as that. Yeah, let's go ahead and save that. Alright, we don't need this, this, this. Whoops, excuse me. This, or this. We do need these as four places. And I'm sorry for being a little bit quiet because I'm kind of like to concentrate and actually get this right. And hey, look there. I like that. Can you make realistic fireworks? I would like to try. Let's just say that. I would like to try to make realistic fireworks. I would love uh, Amnesty would t to teach me the ways of how he makes his uh, so realistic. He would be a great teacher. There we are. Now we have sound people tubes. There you go. Sitting in the bitch. Save that. Alright, let's take a look at it again because we need to look at the wrapper because we finished the inside of it. Uh, does the inside look gray? Yes, it does. So we can just leave that alone. That's cool. Alright, so uh, now let's look at the outside. The outside looks like it has triangles. So let's first by let's first do the triangles. And uh, then we'll continue on our way. So we're going to put this side as three sides. Enter. And why is that not working? Ah, there we go. Wow, it looks good. Thank you. Oh, Amnesty! Speak of the... Okay, speak of the person that I was talking about earlier himself. The gamer, the OG, I'm Amnesty, is here in the chat, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome in. Hey, I'm Amnesty. Welcome on in. How are you doing today? Oh, in my country, it's good night. Yes, it's definitely good night. All right, we are, we are definitely making a triangle, right? Yes, we are definitely making a triangle. All right. So uh, we're going to turn on Hidden Geometry, we're going to go right in the center of this, about, and go up. All 
right, we need to measure that a little bit more. Actually, hold on, we need to do it from this angle. And then... Forgive me if I struggle with this, lit chat. <laughs> As I slowly lose my sanity. Alright, we need to measure it from here. Got it. Okay. We got it. We got it, chat. That's it. That's all we needed. Alright. Um, okay. So, uh, how wide is this triangle? It's actually pretty wide. It probably st stops around the third midpoint in the measuring. It's just 11.39. I mean, right. Goodness, it's like really late. You should be going to bed. Why, why are you staying up to see me? I, I don't realize how late in the day it is that over there. If you play fast and slow, you're gonna lose more insanity. Okay, fair enough. That is fair enough. That that that's a valid point. That is a very valid point. I've seen people play that. It is scary. It is scary. All right. So how wide this is? I'm just gonna move some. Ow. Oh, I know what's wrong. Okay. We hit the angles and then we explode the curves. Duh. Okay. Yeah, it does that. We're gonna go ahead and make this... Can we? Can we follow the line? No, we can't. We can't follow the line. Stink! It means we have to go back up here. Okay. We're learning, Jack. We're learning... I don't know, I think that's too big. <laughs> you just gotta do it right, and then you just have to group it, and that'll be it. That's perfect! That is perfect! I like that, okay. We're gonna make it like a little solid. It's gonna carry on over. And we're only going to use this group. So uh, let's find the center. Make this into a group as well. Why don't I use Blender? It's a good question. Good question. Alright, next. Next question. <laughs> um, in all seriousness, I'm more used to SketchUp. And I've received high marks on, uh... I've received high marks on my modeling skills, so... We're gonna put this in the middle. Isn't GetChip mostly used for making 3D models for 3D printers? And like houses, yes, but you can use it for many things. So you can make people have made weird stuff on SketchUp. It's it's basically another thing for social media. If if, if we're gonna be honest, Blender is very powerful, just like Unity. Once you use it a little bit, you get used to it. But to each their own. Fair enough. I received high marks on my modeling skills and paint skills for each one. Each one is. Each little pixel that I create is personally made from this little paint can, and it looks and it, and and um, the text from UV you can't see the text, but uh, you can just use this little tool and it makes 3D text for you. Anyway, showing off what uh, SketchUp can do, let's go ahead and intersect with model. We're going to go ahead and uh, get rid of these. Wait, is that what I wanted to do? No, it wasn't what I wanted to do. Okay. These are upside down, chat. So we need to go ahead and flip around blue. I knew there was something wrong with that. Okay. Let's try that again. Wait, they're inverse, aren't they? They're inverse. Ah! 
These are the ones that need to be blued. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. That's what I wanted to see. Let's go ahead and save that. Shoot. Okay. Let's go ahead and make a paint with that. Make a perfect little triangle. Actually, we can get rid of hidden geometry now. We can just do that. Look at how easy this is. Look at how easy this is. Already, we have the makings of the Primatical, or whatever this thing is called. And uh, the beginning is black, so let's go ahead and put black in there. And here we are. Now it looks exactly what it is. Almost. We gotta get the fireworks in the background and the text. The text will be last. It's it's amount of layering, so uh, the layering comes next. So since uh, it's almost an exact copy of the next one, we're gonna go ahead and make like little... Uh, we're gonna make this white so we can uh, pixelate it and make it like a little grid and then uh, pixelate it further. We're gonna go ahead and make a helpful, very, very helpful grid. Oops, I should have done it in the model. Hmm. Yeah, I was doing it right. Okay. This is a helpful grid that I use to help me draw better. So I'm going to go ahead and explode that. And instantaneously intersect with model. There we are. And we're stuck with it. Let's go ahead and improve upon this design. Because we can't go beyond this line. And there we go, now we have like a little grid. Alright, so you need to make a firework. Figure out how we can do this. I mean, I made fireworks before, but they're kind of low quality. You might have seen the village one that I did earlier, that was kind of poor. I want to see if I can make like legit streams and things like this. I, I want to try it, chat. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay. Sorry, I zoned out there for a second. I tend to do that. Hmm. Alright. Wonder if Lumenia is gonna add star sticks, if star sticks is a thing in this. What are star sticks? I could add a star stick in my mod. Uh maybe you can like give me a little link. Links are permitted in this channel, no matter what how bad they are. Like self advertisement, you you want to self advertise yourself? Go right ahead. The one channel you could do it. Exactly. That's my question. What are star sticks? <laughs> hmm. Okay. So this thing is gently going to the right. So I'm gonna go gently to the right, as such. Follow that line. One eighth line. What are Roman candles? Uh, you mean Roman candles? Where are Roman candles though? <laughs> Roman candles are candles that Romans made. Yes, one for the pun book. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and look at that up. Commercials! I've been commercialized! Good thing I was muted. And Another commercial!
That's a Roman candle. It's called like a spinning tube. It's like really weird. Oh my goodness, look at how many of these guys have. He bundled it up. He bundled it up, chat. That looks neat. I want to make something like that. And now it's on fire. Apparently, Roman candles never burn out, even in water. Guys, we have English translate. We can, like, legit, like, translate that, can't we? We can legit translate that. Let's, let's go ahead and translate that. Yes, Roman candles go off in water, that's right. If you guys right. want to buy these Roman candles for yourself, they are called Joints and Blunts, and you can purchase them with my link in the description of this video. Fireworks shooting stars, yep, yeah, that's what it translates to. Magnesia flares, they burn into water. Okay. So, flares. Yeah, we like flares. If you want to make flares, yeah, sure. Let's make flares. Uh, but first comes this. This comes first. Uh, I'm actually uh, kind of under the gun to make this because I kind of promised Dan that I would make it today. And it's today, so let's make it. So, uh, we're making it, chat. I might make that later, though. So we're gonna make like a little uh like a little square kind of It's gonna have like multicolored, so it looks like a little trail that came from a firework. That's my plan, anyway. This is art right here. This is this is where art. Yeah, I have sparklers already. You should download the February fireworks mod. It has it has can do sparklers in it. Unfortunate that I won't be able to edit it again because I lost the mod. Due to updates, it happens. Why a big base? Yeah, I get that. But hey, it's weird but different. We like weird on this channel. Weird is accepted. That's why I'm a furry. Ha! Got him. We're gonna finish it off with a little straight arrow maybe here. Alright, so now we have, it's basically like just drawing the blanks right here, but creating it is kind of hard, isn't it? Yeah, it's kind of hard, so uh, so in the background, it's probably going to look like this. Do, 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 do. This is the art problem. A surprise boom would be fun, though. You want a surprise boom? You want a surprise boom? There, there's a surprise boom. Boom sound effect. Provided by Kendu Studios. <laughs> Uh, can you hear me? Uh, press 1 in chat if you can hear me, and if I'm not muted or not. I, I do happen to know that sometimes that happens. Ah, 
Uh, sorry if I'm really quiet, Chad. I'm just this is this is how I work. This is this is. I would not accept this. I, if I was sitting here and just watching this guy paint, it would be like, man, this guy's boring. Okay, good. Bread. Mm. <clears throat> Sparkling on a stick that burns and has some bread. Bread. Good. Good that you can hear me. It's really delayed, though. It's very delayed stream, apparently. So, uh... This is how people work. Alright, if I get rid of the edges, what would it look like? Hmm. 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 Interesting. Alright, so first of all, I want to change this little color. Because... It just looks weird. So I want to change to these colors. Decision making progress. Oh yes, I like that. See, it fades at the bottom and it's brighter on the top. I like that. I like that. Yeah, let's keep that. Alright, so now we need to make the firework itself. How do I delete a message? Which one? Which one, Alex the Gamer? This one? <laughs> I don't know. I don't I don't really know. Alright, let's continue on. It's not like you're gonna get demonetized for saying something like free speech. Free speech, man! It's all about the free speech! I hereby insinuate free speech to say the following. Ah! <laughs> that should be a clip. That should legit be a clip. <laughs> that was good. Alright, so uh, how big should this be? Am I Netherlands? What, you think I'm Netherlands just because of my accent? Maybe he's not talking to me. <laughs> hmm. I'm going to do the best I can to make a firework, alright? I'm not the best when it comes to fireworks, but I'm going to do my best. See, when you make stuff like this line by line, it feels more personalized. You can't just rip it off the internet and just say, oh, I'm done. This is an art form. This, this is a legit art form. Oh, you're German. I didn't know that, Keltasar. That's that's actually nice to know. Now I can legit say Ickmanheim. My liege. Or something. Oh, I got the wrong tool. I got the wrong track. I think my father's home, which means I might have to stop it to help my father out with his loading the truck and everything. Oh, I am not even trying to... Okay, whoops. I am not German, no! What's why my name has the word DE on your phone or German, the flag and disc... Oh! Okay, now it makes sense. Ah, his secret has been revealed! Or however Grave Mind says it in Halo 3. 
I am actually yes, I am from the U.S. Which is why it's 5:50 on the time. You're right. I am from Eastern Standard Time. So, uh, yeah, I'm from the U.S. Congratulations, you win. You win a sad feeling. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Okay. I should really stop with the memes and stuff. It's It's how I cope with working. This is fun. This is fun for me, guys. This is fun. Talking to people while I work. Living in America for about one year, really. Well, what did you think of our country? Did it stink? Did it sound different? Probably sounded different and you didn't like it. <laughs> I'm going to give it... Need some work stamp of approval. Psh, don't we all? Don't we all, Super Drizzle? Don't we all? Portland, Oregon. Oh, I've heard so many good place things about that place. Um, um, and to be honest, I like it. Oh yes, Oregon was a great. Oregon is a great place. I hear. That's what I hear. Anyway. I never seen it though. Well, the dog's going crazy, so I need to go at it and uh, do something about it. So uh, dance break, everybody, while I go uh, fix my dog. Uh, chat, I was right. Uh, my father is home. I will have to help him uh, unpack some things in the truck. So uh, yeah, it's gonna be like um, it's gonna be like a fifteen minute break. Uh, should we raid somebody? Be be should I just end the stream? Like suggestions, chat. Should I read the stream, or should I just keep it on the be right back screen? All right, yeah, we're good. okay. We're gonna yeah, we're we're definitely gonna be right back. Chat, it's gonna be like fifty minutes. I'm I'm sorry. Test test. There we go. It, it should be it should be good. We're gonna be right back. Chat.
Spotifyers. Click or tap the banner to listen to chill vibes. Just chill. Brought to you by our friends at Rockstar Unplugged, a new kind of energy drink. Any suggestions of where you should read today? Chat? Chat? Any suggestions of where we should read today? Let's go find out where we should read today. Let's see, we got Chatty Driver, we got Kazu. Is Kazu still on? She's just been on for like 24 hours. Uh, we can. Uh. Chatty Driver is kind of sweet, but, uh, I don't think you guys would stay, so, uh. Let's give old Kazu a chance to actually get raided today. I mean, how many times have we often have we said, hey, I actually have people in my stream. Check this out. Um, let, no, let's go for saving. I, it's hard to decide. I hope you guys are still here because we're raiding. Thank you guys so much for uh, watching this. And if you liked it, you know, give it a good old like. And of course, hit the bell icon so you never miss another episode. But until then, dream of foxes. And I will see you next time. But until then, I bid you in your household, peace. Let's read!